imagine you're looking for a company or you found a business partner and you want to do business with. But you don't, but you don't know anything about the person or his company. You want to look and find out if his company is registered or not. How do you do that? In this video, I'm going to show you how you can do that in the Netherlands. In a future video, I will show you how you can do that in other countries. But let's start with the Netherlands. Let's begin. Test one, two, three. Test one, two, three. Sometimes. Sometimes when you do business in the Netherlands, it's important to know if the company is, exists or not. So it's important to know if there is a company in the Netherlands or not. In this video, I'm going to show you. In this video, I'm going to show you. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can check if a company is, exists or not. So when you're doing business, it's important to know if someone has a company in the Netherlands. So you can check in KVK. KVK means Chamber of Commerce in the Netherlands. And the other thing which you can do is use Google. And I'm going to show you how you can use Google to see if a company exists or not. And you can also see uh, what kind of company it is and what kind of clients they have. So let's start. So we are on Google. Let's go to KVK first. I just look uh, a random company. So when we when we at the site we press Suken. Suken means search in Netherlands. When you search, you search in the under register. This means um, this is the register of the company. So you can look for companies here, and you don't really need to look for this. Just le press here and press the name of the company or the Chamber of Commerce number. So you press it. As you can see, it will find one company. If I if I'm looking for another company that has the name Apple in it, for example, Pink Apple, Apple Pen, I just press the name here in it, and we will find it. If I'm looking, for, if I only have the Chamber of Commerce number, for example, this one. Let's copy this one. If I only have that one, I will put it, and it will show me this to me. It's important to know the name of the Chamber of Commerce number so you can find it here. For example, this is a legit company. But um, let's go back. As you can see, this is Big Apple Amusement. Let's Google it and see what kind of what you will find. Netherlands. As you can see, TripAdvisor trip referred them. So uh, the big now. As you can see, there's a big Apple amusement. So let's let's Google them. Copy. Then Google big Apple amusement, and this is it. So let's look them up. As you can see, they have a Facebook account. So, but this is in the U UK. But if I'm looking for big Apple amusement in the Netherlands. Let's see what we can find. As you can see, this is their Google page. They have three reviews. They have also a website, if I'm correct. As you can see, this is a company, Big Apple, casino company. And it has a lot of places. It's in a lot of places in the Netherlands, for in Arnhem, Tio, Zevenaar, and Winterswijk. So uh, if you're doing business with uh, the Big Apple Amusement, BV, you will find it here. So these are a way that you can find out if a company is legit or not. But just look in the Chamber of Commerce and look on the cave, um, Chamber of Commerce number or the name if they are registered or not. And sometimes you can ask them for the RS for their FAT number and the FAT number will give you more information about them if they are registered as an commercial company or not. In this video, I showed you how you can find out if a company is registered in the Netherlands. 
If you want to do business in the Netherlands or anything else, feel free to contact me. I will see what I can do for you. See you in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.